Financial Literacy Final Exam. Do the calculations on a separate sheet of paper provided by the teacher. Number one, which of the following has the least influence on an individual's values? Is it A, media, B, family, or D, grade average? Two, a need is best defined as B, something thought to be a necessary or essential items required for life. C, a fundamental belief or practice about what is desirable, worthwhile, and important to an individual. Or D, something unnecessary but desired or items which increase the quality of living. Back to number two, the question is a need is best defined as. Three, goals are most likely to be accomplished if an individual A, lets his or her parents set their goals, C, writes their goals down, or D, thinks about goals often. Four, what is financial planning? A, a fundamental belief or practice about what is desirable and worthwhile. B, a process used to achieve financial success based upon financial goals and plans. Or D, a set of financial documents including net worth, a will, and insurance policies. Five, before a renter is allowed to take possession of rental property, they are expected to A, pay the utility bill and give notice of mo the moving date. C, acquire renter's insurance and pay property taxes. Or D, pay a security deposit or sign a lease. Six, the government uses money collected from taxes to A, finance the Internal Revenue Service, B, encourage private enterprise, or D, provide goods and services for the public. Seven, a dependent is a person who a. Relies on the taxpayer for financial support. B. Relies on the government for their Social Security benefit. Or D. Depends on their job for needed financial support to pay their expenses. When you're done, turn to the next page. Use the following questions, 8 through 9. Bob is working for a bank. He earns $8 an hour, 40 days a week, and gets paid every two weeks. He pays $63.08 for federal withholding, $33.21 into state withholdings, and $42.05 into FICA, or F-I-C-A. 8. What is Bob's gross pay on his paycheck? You have choices, you have some time to figure, and then pick A, B, C, or D. I think you just need to figure out how much he makes in total before we do withholding. You can stop the recording right now if you need to. If not, move on to number nine. What is Bob's net pay on his paycheck? That's where you subtract from his total. Take some time. Stop the player if you need to. Press play when you're ready to move on. Number 10, a spending plan is affected by which of the following factor? A, needs, B, values, C, wants, or D, all of the above. Eleven, if expenses were to exceed income on a spending plan, what would be a financially smart, smart solution? A, decrease your expenses. C, earn less income. Or D, increase purchases.
2012, depository institutions offer a wide variety of services, including A, checking and savings accounts, B, loans and investments, C, financial counseling, D, all of the above. Thirteen, funds deposited in a federally insured account, or FDIC, are protected against loss for up to A, $50,000, B, $1 million, C, $250,000. Fourteen, electronic banking allows the consumer to B, correct fraud or identity theft as soon as it occurs, C, have three to four days of float time after a check is written, or D, have 24-7 access to banking transactions. Turn the page to number 15, which doesn't have a number. It's at the top of page 3. When comparing and contrasting debit and credit cards, it could be said that a, debit cards allow for overspending, and credit cards are limited to the amount in the bank account. B, a debit card withdraws money from a bank account for immediate payment instead of making purchases on credit. Or C, credit cards are not widely accepted by stores, but debit cards are. 16. In order to use online banking safely when making a purchase or when paying a bill, a person should make sure to A. Make transactions using their personal email account. B. Use an account that is password protected. C. Make sure that the bank website uses HTTPS's in the URL and the closed padlock icon. D. B and C only or E. A, B and C. 17. What does pay yourself first mean? A. An individual should save mon whatever money is left after paying the monthly bills. B. An individual should pay all fixed expenses before paying flexible expenses. C. An individual should consider having savings to be a fixed expense. 17. What does pay yourself first mean? A, an individual should have whatever money is left over. Oh, I read that before. Let's go to 18. 18, which of the following statements correctly describes the security level of savings tools? A, saving tools are not secure because they have a high risk of losing money. B, savings tools are secure because they are protected by the U.S. government against loss. Or C, savings tools are very secure because there are no risks involved with saving and investing. 19. When purchasing an automobile, subtracting the down payment from the negotiated price before adding interest is A. Total cost of the loan B. Monthly payment or C. APR And the last one for part one of the reading, number 20. This occurs when the tenant does not voluntarily move out after the landlord has given the required notice to the tenant. This is called A. Amenities B, eviction, or D, no lease agreement.